your latest news update from Western Mass News. Good afternoon, I'm Jordan Jagelinzer. Here's your latest news update from Western Mass News. The executive director of superintendents speaking out as concerns continue to mount over the return of in-person learning. Thomas Scott tells Western Mass News frustrations are growing over COVID-19 testing kit trouble, as well as staffing shortages. The Mass Department of Elementary and Secondary Education says they are working to get more masks for teachers. With snow in our forecast for the end of the week, Western Mass News caught up with several local DPW crews to see how they're faring amid the surge of COVID-19 cases in the region. We're told crews both in Springfield and in the Hill Towns are staffed and ready to go. They say they are keeping a close eye on cases and they will follow all safety protocols for workers. Icy roads creating quite the scene this morning across our area. Some local schools delayed and many commuters running into issues slipping and sliding onto the roads. Crews responding to several crashes, even some first responders having a tough time on the icy roads. Western Mass News cameras were rolling when a fire engine started sliding on Nottingham Street in Springfield. Temperatures are back up above freezing and should stay there through at least midnight, but a cold front will pass through not long after midnight. And once that front passes by, skies will start to clear out a little bit. Temperatures will drop back down below freezing with many falling into the 20s. So black ice is a possibility overnight into early uh, tomorrow morning. Now it isn't looking too rough out there in terms of black ice, but any untreated road surfaces will again be slippery. Going into our Thursday, we'll have a mixture of sunshine and increasing high clouds throughout the day. It'll be a bit cooler with highs back in into the middle and upper 30s. Plus, we'll have a bit more of a breeze around. Now, winter storm watches have already been issued for Southeast Mass and Rhode Island ahead of Friday snow. No advisories, watches, or warnings up for Western Mass at this point. We are expecting some accumulating snowfall, but it should stay on the minor side. However, it looks uh, to impact the morning commute. Timing-wise, snow could be falling during the Friday morning commute, really slowing things down throughout southern New England. Behind that system will be breezy, sunny, and colder, with highs in the upper 20s on Saturday. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.